But it was a tough physical game. You know, every year we play Walsh, it's a, it's a dog fight. We, we've really got a great rivalry going. And both teams uh, really buckle up and, and lay it out there for four quarters. Don't leave anything. You know, it's all left out on the field. And it was a hard-fought football game, a physical game. We're a little beat up right now. Uh, but we found a way to win, uh, made plays when we had to. I thought our defense really, uh, really matured last week, really came about because that's an offense that's just been uh, week to week running the ball right down in people's throats. So we uh, tested our manhood, and, and we responded very well. Offensively, uh, our quarterback play has been outstanding. Turney is playing very well. I think he was 30 of 37 last week for 300-plus yards. Uh, I'll take that every week. Um, you weren't down by a lot, but you were down early in that game, as you have been quite a few games. What does it say about this team? Keep coming back in games to get to win. Got great kids, kids of character. Uh, you know, the chemistry is so good right now. They like each other. We have fun. It's. Uh, I look forward to walking out on the practice field every day, uh, and I think our players do too. Um, it, it's really fun and it's exciting to see the day-to-day -day improvement, which that is happening. Um, halfway through the season, at least according to the rankings, you've beaten three pretty quality teams. You say them beginning pretty young teams. Is this team playing up to its capabilities? Well, it's hard to say what the capabilities are. You know, I I, uh, I, I look at the athletic potential. And potential is overrated word, you know. But I look at uh, the possibilities are exciting. Now, how well we develop, how quickly we develop, uh, depends on us. Um, I, I would say that, that we're we're on target. Um, thought if we could hang on these first five weeks, that by midseason we'd be pretty good. And uh, we've had some tough competition early. So here we are. We've survived it. Uh, we're still unblemished at, at midway. Still have some difficult challenges down the road. But uh, we're a lot better football team now than we were even three weeks ago. So uh, optimism, I think, uh, within our coaching staff would explain it well. Anything about this team that surprised you so far? Um, I think just the uh, the positive attitude, uh, where it's been fun. Football practice sometimes is tough, and you know we we practice two days a week, seven o'clock in the morning, and uh, that is difficult for young people to deal with. And our kids love it. Uh, attitude of uh, doing what we ask them to do has uh, is, is enjoyable. I mean that's what you want. You know I say to our players, if you do the things we ask you to do the best of your ability, we'll achieve great things. Very rarely do you get 100% uh, cooperation and commitment. Um, but the higher percentage of that you get, the better opportunity you have to become a great football team. Right now, that percentage is pretty high. Uh, Trinity next week, 3-4 and four record, but as they proved last week, they don't give up in games. What does that game look like? Well, you, you know, you're right. They've won three games. They were down 34 to nothing. Came back, won 41 40. Won three football games this year. They won three football games in the last five years. So it is a team with a new coaching staff that uh, has confidence. They play hard. Uh, anytime you spread it out and throw it and run the option, they're, they're dangerous. They've got some good players. Um, we've just got to take care of ourselves at this point and continue to respect all, fear none, and play our best.